heart I can't forget Even now I realize the time will never get Another story of the bitter pulls of fate I can't go back again, I can't go back again But you asked me to love you when I did Trading my emotions for a contract to commit And when I got away I only got so far Today I'm going to show you how to edit any web page. Now you can do this with Firefox or Safari. I'm just going to show you how to do it with Firefox today. Okay, so you're going to open up Firefox. And what you're going to do is you're going to go to the address bar. Um, and you're going to put this code right here. Um, this code will be in the description to the right of this video. So um, all you have to do is copy and paste. But the code is... Java, JavaScript, which is just the type this is, and then document body. That's this whole um, that's this whole web page right here, like the whole thing. Content editable equals true. That means you can edit anything you want on the web page, and then that means yes, you can. Document um, design mode on. That means. You can basically design it yourself, like move things around and stuff. And so basically all you have to do is put this code in and then click enter. And then it'll look the same, but really you can edit anything. Like watch. Click the Google icon. I can resize it. Oops, resize it. It's grabbing it. You can make it huge if you want. You can make it huge. Move it around anyway. Um, that's pretty cool, I think. And then you can delete it. Um, all you have to do is click the delete button, um, and so it'll delete. And then you could also edit text if you want. For exam an example is um, you could go to, um, let's say, images. If you don't want images, you can click on it and then delete it, and then put like photos or something like that something something else and um maybe you want I don't know you could put your name like that um that's pretty cool um oops and um you can change anything you want so let's say you don't even want this at all you don't want any of this text highlight it and delete it's all gone I think basically you can delete anything on here really um, you could delete all that. <laughs> Basically, all it leaves is this stuff up here. And, but this is only temporary. It's not going to be like this forever because all you have to do is go back to google.com and it's back to normal. And, um, you can do this on basically every single web page. And, um, like, you can do it on YouTube, for example go to YouTube and um, here my name right here Mac Tutorials 101 all I have to do is go to the top and put the code click enter and then my name right here I click on it and I start deleting it and then I could put anything I wanted my name I'm pretty cool um, and you could change the upload icon or the upload text. You just put anything you want. Um, if you want to upload, and then click and click away, and then yeah. Um, and then you can do the same thing with the icon, with or almost the same thing, except. Instead of resizing the icon, when you drag it out, it shows you every single icon that YouTube uses to make their web page. Now that is pretty cool, I think, because you can view what icons they use to make their web page. And if you don't want that anymore, all you have to do is resize it back to what it was, um, YouTube. And it's, I think it's really neat how you can edit any web page. Um, with this JavaScript, um, you could rename a video. Um, let's see, just delete the name. 
and then you go to you can even delete the which we'll call it the description and then just type anything um this is the video I edited with the code ha 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 and um yeah so you can make it anything you want um but apple apple is a little bit different because instead of all this being text this is just a big picture so i'm going to paste the code and then click enter all this is is it's ba it's basically like a big picture can't edit this at all but these you can edit this um edit this too watch video you can move that around anywhere you want and um you can y here you can edit text that that's pretty good i think you can edit text here and then um justin oh no justin owns apple.com or something like that i don't know you can put anything like that edit text any way you want almost and then so you can't do anything with that though but you can take this icon right here and then drag it like that and then these are all the ways they use like this is if you aren't doing anything um the second bar is if you're highlighting something this is if you just clicked it um the third one is if you clicked it and then the fourth one is if you're on that um that put that page of this website that is cool I think um, and if by the way if you don't want to keep having to copy and paste the code all you have to do is highlight this and then click on it hold it and then drag it add it as a bookmark um, control click it and then go to I believe its properties yes and then just name it edit this page and then save changes and then let's say you want to go back to google.com just click edit this page and then you don't have to paste the code that's, that's helpful very helpful and um that is how you edit any web page um thank you for watching and subscribe to my videos